If you remove the sensor ring and it moves, or you are installing a new one, you will need to recalibrate it. You're going to be removing the steering wheel airbag to access the steering sensor. Before you begin, disconnect the negative, then positive cables from the battery with a 10mm socket, and wait at least 20 minutes for the residual energy in the system to dissipate. With the battery disconnected and having waited 20 minutes, remove the steering wheel and the airbag, red arrow. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with those tasks. Make a mark on the steering sensor where the white arrow is on the ring indicated by the red arrow. If the wheel was straight, it should be at the 1 o'clock. When installing the new sensor, the arrow must line up between the two marks on the ring indicated by the blue arrows. Use a T10 torque and remove the two small screws, red arrow, one on each side, that hold the upper steering column trim piece in place. You can just leave the wiring in place and set the cover up out of the way. You want to remove the harness from the clips red arrow, and then separate the leather piece by unclipping it, green arrows, that will give you more room to work. Use a T10 torque and remove the single screw holding the lower trim piece in place indicated by the red arrow. You can just lower this, but if you want to remove it for more room, separate the wiring clip from the trim piece, red arrow. The steering sensor is attached to the column switches. The clips on the sensor can be very brittle, so I like to remove the unit from the steering shaft by removing the 4mm Allen, red arrow. Slide the unit off the steering shaft and disconnect the wiring harness, red arrow, from the turn signal assembly, blue arrow. Disconnect the electrical connection from the sensor indicated by the red arrow. With the unit off, you can see the markings on the sensor, red arrow, and where it plugs into the column switches, blue arrows. The sensor is held in place by five clips. Release the two on the top, red arrows. Release the lower one, red arrow. Then the two on each side. You can now remove the sensor from the unit. If you are installing a new sensor, make sure to set the sensor arrow, red arrow, between the two markings on the ring, blue arrows. Installation is the reverse of removal. If the airbag contact unit setting has changed accidentally, it must be adjusted. To position the airbag contact unit in the central position, Press the locking element and turn the rotor carefully to the left as far as it will go. Then turn the rotor carefully to the right approximately 3.5 to 3.75 revolutions until the lock engages. The arrow marking on the rotor must be positioned between the arrow markings on the contact ring. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.